Are you receiving more leaks now in the wake of what we saw? That leak forced DNC National Committee Chair Debbie Wasserman Schultz to step down. And now Assange is threatening an October surprise for Hillary Clinton, promising to release documents that could affect the election. Watch. It's a, a variety of different types of documents from different uh, types of institutions that are associated uh, with the uh, election campaign. Uh, some quite um, unexpected uh, angles that are, that are you know, quite interesting, some, um, some even entertaining. There's an interesting article on RT from Julian Assange. He said a vote for Hillary Clinton is a vote for endless stupid war that spreads terrorism. And of course, he kind of ran down her resume, and I thought it was very interesting. I want to read a couple of quotes of, of what he tweeted out. Julian Assange said, uh, a vote today for Hillary Clinton is a vote for endless stupid war, Years of experience in dealing with Hillary Clinton have and have read thousands of her cables. He said uh, Hillary lacks judgment, will push the U.S. into endless wars, which will spread terrorism. And then he kind of summed up her experience here. Because, you know, when you look at the exit polls coming out of uh, New Hampshire, the breakdown in terms of uh, the Democrat voters, they said 32 uh, percent of them were looking for a candidate who was honest and trustworthy. Another 27% said the thing that they were looking for first in a candidate was someone who cared about people. Okay, now if you total those up, the 32, the 27, that's 59%. That's basically what Bernie Sanders got. Then you've got another 27% who said they wanted a candidate with the right experience. 13% who said they wanted electability. You total those two up, you got 40%. That's essentially what Hillary got. So on Hillary's side, you know, people are voting for Bernie Sanders because they think he's honest, uh, authentic that he's trustworthy, he cares about people, okay? The people who are supporting Hillary Clinton are supporting her because they like her experience, they like her electability. Now, her electability took a big hit yesterday, but let's talk first about her experience. And let's let Julian Assange speak. What he said was, Libya has been destroyed. It's become a haven for ISIS. The Libyan National Army Armory was looted. Hundreds of tons of weapons were transferred to jihadists in Syria. Having learned nothing from the Libyan disaster, Hillary then set about trying to do the same thing in Syria. Hillary's war has increased terrorism, killed tens of thousands of innocent civilians, has set back women's rights in the Middle East by hundreds of years. Okay, so that's from someone who is essentially on the, on the Democrat side. Yes, we came, we saw, he died. Yes, we came, we saw, he died. 